Well, hello, my friend, and welcome to my channel. Today, I've got a quick little video, <laughs> and this one is my, for my friend Daphne. Um, she wanted to know how she was looking for some inexpensive jelly polishes, and I have been watching just a ton of videos here lately um, on YouTube about this very matter. So I figured I would just jump on in and do this. Now I've got about a half full. Let me. Okay. It's up to about this line. It's about a half full bottle of just the Wet n Wild Clear Nail Protector. And um, we're just going to open this up and scrape off the extra on the brush. And get it ready. And today I'm going to use this eye contact. And um, we're going to get started with this one. And uh, if I can get it open. Um, I, I don't have a jelly in this color. So I figured I would you know, start with something I don't already own. And it's kind of a sheer polish anyway. So I thought this one might be a good one. I'm going to start with eight drops. I've never done this before. Like I said, I've watched lots of videos. So um, <laughs> we're going to see how this goes. And you just shake it up. And I'm going to do this off camera just because, you know, it gets dizzying. And there you go. You can see it's it mixed up really quick, actually. Like that. Just shake it up. And I'm going to... Let's get something out. Let me grab something real quick so we can kind of test. Oh, look. We got a stamper right here. So, here we go. We can brush it on the stamper. And you can see there's a tinge of color. But not like if you painted it on its own. And the reason why I like this is because if you wanted it darker, you can keep adding drops until you get it the opacity that you want. See, that's looking just maybe a little too light, so I'm going to add some more. And this is like a grayed out, super duper light purple. So I'm going to add probably four more drops. And you could, you know, do any color in your collection. You could, you know, do greens and teals and just make up any, any, I'm going to shake it up off camera again, any color you want. Because you're just sharing that polish out. So there we go. Mix that up some more. I don't think that's going to make a huge, huge difference on it. But it did, look. Look at that. This swipe over here is after the four extra drops. So you might want to be very careful as you're doing it and maybe do just add the one drop at a time. Um, you know, but I really do like that. I think this is a really neat way to, you know, make your own. And you can get, you know, any kind of, you can use Wet n Wild. You can use, you know, I use a lot of that. Um, let me see if I can find mine real quick. Like you can buy these super dries at the Dollar Tree. These would probably work really well also. And, um, you know, just, just some inexpensive clear. Um, and then just add drops of your favorite shades and, and make you a rainbow of colors. So I want to thank Daphne for the um, request. Or, you know, she didn't actually request specifically this. But I told her that I would do this. And, um... That is it for today. So I hope you enjoyed this one. Leave me a comment down below and let me know what you think of this. And that is all I have for you today. Until next time, be good to yourself. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.